Hello everyone, welcome to the video tutorial of PrestaShop Age Verification Module. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how the store owner can prevent underage users from browsing his website by adding an age verification pop-up on his store. If the store owner's website contains explicit content or the store owner deals in products such as tobacco or alcohol, then he must verify the age of the users. So let's see how this particular extension works and for that I am taking you to the admin back office. This is the admin's back office and uh, let's start with the installation process first. First of all, go to Modules and Services tab. Then click on Upload a Module button and then click on Select File. The module configuration is basically divided into two parts. One is General Configuration and uh, the second is Design Settings. Let's start with general configuration first. First of all, admin has to specify the minimum age of users required for browsing the website. Suppose admin has set 18 in this field. From here, admin can upload the image which will be visible to the users on age verification pop-up. Admin can also delete this image by clicking here. In these fields, admin has to enter age verification title and description, which will be displayed on the age verification pop-up. Suppose admin has set here age verification as the title. User must be at least 18 years old to enter the website. In these fields, admin can set the confirm and deny button text, which will be displayed on the age verification pop up. Suppose he has entered yes in the confirm button text and no in the deny button text in this field admin has to set the url on which the user will be redirected after clicking on deny button suppose admin has set here www google.com in this field set the message which will be displayed on the age verification pop-up if the user's age is less than that of the specified age suppose admin has said you are not eligible to enter into this website. Enable disable the display of terms and conditions link on the age verification pop-up. If enabled, then admin can select the CMS page on which the user will be redirected after clicking on terms and conditions link. From here, admin can enable disable the display of date of birth field on the age verification to verify the user's age. In this field, admin can select the pages on which the age verification pop-up will not be displayed. Suppose 
he has selected contact page and uh, history page admin can set the number of days after which the age verification pop up will be displayed again to the visitor suppose admin has set 3 here so the age verification pop up will be again displayed to the visitor after 3 days admin can also enable disable the age verification process for the registered customers from here if enabled then admin can specify the number of days after which age verification pop up will be displayed again to the registered customer suppose admin has set 7 in this field so that the age verification pop up will be displayed again to the registered customer after 7 days click here to save the module settings after configuring the module settings let's have a look at the age verification pop up on the front end when a user visits the website a pop up will be displayed as shown here a user can view age verification pop up image age verification title and description here a user has to enter his date of birth for age verification if the user's age is less than the defined age then a deny message will be displayed on the age verification as specified by admin from back end and if user's age matches the defined criteria then after clicking on confirm button user will be able to browse the website and in case the user simply clicks on deny button then he will be redirected to the url as specified by admin from backend as we can see that the user has been redirected to google.com after clicking on deny button now let's have a look at the design settings of the module admin can customize the look and feel of age verification as per requirement using the design settings admin can set the background color of age verification and uh, set the background color opacity of the pop up from this field admin can set the border color of age verification pop up image and uh, from these fields admin can set the text color and background color of confirm and deny buttons now after customizing the age verification pop up let's have a look at it on the front end click here to save the design settings after configuring the design settings let's have a look at the age verification pop up at the uh, front end now from here we can see that to uh, admin has customized the age verification pop up by setting its background color background color of age verification pop up image and uh, text and background color of confirm and deny buttons 